Now, her mantelpiece is groaning under the weight of trophies, but now a woman from Clevedon can proudly say she is the fastest woman in the world on water. Zara Davis uses a specially adapted windsurf board and she's just been to Central Africa where the conditions are right to take on the world record. Chris James reports. And this is the moment. Believe it or not, this is only just slower than a cruising lorry on a motorway. Zara Davis, who's from Clevedon, is skimming along the surface of the water at 52.7 miles an hour, a new world record. I went with three aims, really. First of all, to break 40 knots, because only two women have ever been over 40 knots. Second of all, to break the world record. And then third of all, to do about 43 knots, which is about 50 mile an hour, because it was a good figure to talk about. First time I broke the world record, I did the 43, I think it was 43.78 knots the first time. And actually, I was a bit teary, so I came out of the water. Zara had to travel to Namibia to take on the challenge. This man-made narrow channel in Luderitz is said to be perfect. And certainly when at speed, it's an adrenaline rush. But it's not all plain sailing when trying to stop a skinny surfboard at 50 miles an hour. I uh, managed to cut my head open um, by hitting the mast um, and managed to cut my leg open on the side of my board um, and had about 30 stitches in total. So, um, yeah, but everything's healing well now. And to be honest, in speed sailing, you know, you, if you don't have a few crashes, then uh, it's not proper speed sailing. Back in Somerset, Zara trains about 15 hours a week mainly in Western Supermare, Burnham and sometimes Weymouth. But at her local windsurfing club at Axbridge Lake, where she's a mentor, she's become a bit of a hero figure. Where did the sail go? I showed the kids the difference between my board and theirs and um, you know, difference in weight. They were quite surprised. My board's very light. It weighs about five kilos. Um, their board's probably about 18 kilos. So it takes two of them to take it to the beach, you know. Zara's now waiting for her certificate to arrive, which she can put with her raft of many other surfing trophies she's won this year. But at 53 miles an hour, this is one cool way to surf into the record books. Chris James, BBC Points West, Clevedon. Brilliant.